So let's deploy SMB over quick. I'm going to configure this on my Edge file server, uh, Windows Server 2022 Azure Edition. So what I need to do this is Windows Admin Center, as you probably guessed. I've got my sales team share. So I'm going to go ahead and configure uh, settings for this server. You'll notice that I have a new option here when I get to file shares that's for configuring SMB over quick. And it's really easy. You're going to blink and miss it. So I click configure. I pick a certificate that's been issued to the server that meets the requirements. I make sure that I specify which names, which are on that certificate, are used to connect to this edge file server. It can have several different names, different ways you want to connect. And that's, that's it. I mean, you can look at advanced settings if you want, but you shouldn't need to. You just go ahead and pick a cert and hit enable and you are good to go. And that is done. I have configured SMB over quick on the file server. So now let's see this experience right you know, today where I'm using uh, SMB like normal with TCP, right? I've got a share here. So I'm a Z drive. I'm a salesperson. I'm opening up my uh, traveling sales pitch. I just use this to make my big sales, in which case I'm selling some dog cleaning products that are really going to revolutionize the market. Okay. So that works. And now let's put this user on the road. So they're out and about. Um, they can't get to their server anymore because you know you can't get to TCP uh, SMB over the internet. So just to simulate this, you know, right now here's all the ways that you know the Windows firewall is allowing SMB inbound connections on your you know regular file server. I'm going to simulate just being out on the on the road by setting up a rule that blocks TCP SMB 445. So there's no way anymore to do SMB like you've been doing it for the last. Uh, 20 years. It's just not allowed anymore. So with Quick, things are going to be very interesting. So let, I'm out on the road. I should not be able to connect anymore over TCP, right? So I have the same user, nothing up my sleeve. Double click that file. It still works. It still opens because I'm using SMB over Quick right now. I'm no longer using TCP. And if I switch to one of those other names that I chose, that works too. Try that out. Bada bing, here comes my sales pitch with Darby the sales dog. As easy as that. The user doesn't see any real difference in the experience. And under the covers, what's really happening is, you want to take a look at Wireshark and get a little bit gritty here. Um, when I'm actually opening this file up, I'm no longer, like I said, using TCP. I'm actually on UDP 443 now, um, something which is a very internet friendly um, you know, transport, but I'm inside of a TLS tunnel. So I am in AES 128 or 256 encrypted uh, safety, opening this file. And the again, you saw the user experience hasn't changed. But under the covers, I'm no longer using SMB in a normal fashion like I have for years. I'm using Quick. Pretty slick, right?